Hello, this is Milton Keynes Kia's 2015 Kia Seed 1.6 CRDI2 model. It's finished in this striking track red with black and grey cloth upholstery. It's done just 11,000 miles from new. Really, really fantastic looking vehicle. Uh, let's have a look around the car. It's a very high spec car and uh, it's also in lovely condition as we'll see. Now it comes with these um, very smart 16 inch alloy wheels all of which are scuff and chip free and they're all fitted with good quality Michelin tyres as well. No marks whatsoever along the bodywork again all scuff and chip free no marks on any of the wheels it's just a really really smart looking vehicle. It's got some reversing sensors in the rear bumper to help with reverse parking Offside rear, uh, rear alloy, we can see there, and again, all down the offside of the car, it's pristine with no marks whatsoever. Offside front alloy, again, chip and scuff free, no marks on the front of the car. This is the facelifted model with a slightly different front grille and the chrome embellishments around the uh, front fog lights there. We've got LED daytime running lights on the car as well. Indicators are built into the door mirrors here as you can see. So let's have a look inside. Very smart two-tone black and grey cloth upholstery as you can see here. Again, uh, newly trimmed for this model year. And it's in immaculate condition throughout. There are no marks at all. No uh, smells inside the car either, so never been smoked in or had any pets in here. Plenty of room in the back, we've got mat pockets in here. Uh, we've got an armrest that pulls down out of the rear seat there with a couple of cup holders in it. Adjustable rear head restraints and Isofix child seat fixing points as well. Very, very spacious car is the Seed. Plenty of room for a family of five. Electric rear windows in the back as well. Okay, let's have a look in the boots. And we've got a really good sized boot here. It's got a split folding rear seat as well, should you need any extra space. It's quite deep. And underneath the boot floor, we've got some extra storage as well, should you want to hide things away. And again, scuff and scratch free in there as well. Okay, if we have a look onto the driver's door here, and we can see the switches for the four electric windows. All four windows are auto up and down, so that's just one tap of the button to lower and raise the windows. And over on the right hand side here, we've got the uh, switch for the stop and go system which saves fuel and reduces the emissions of the vehicle whilst it's sitting in traffic um, dashboard rear stats and electric headlamp levelling electric door mirrors and the button to fold the door mirrors in which you can set to auto so that they fold in and out when the vehicle is locked and unlocked very nice multi-spoke leather covered steering wheel and we've got the different steering modes on this button here for sport, comfort and normal which changes the feel of the steering. Um, cruise control settings are there and trip computer settings are lower down. And on the left hand side we've got the buttons for the stereo controls and a bit lower down we've got the Bluetooth controls for making and receiving Bluetooth phone calls. Um, we've got a height adjustable driver's seat as well. So let's have a look inside the car. So we start it up and we can see it's done just 11,120 miles. A very smart three binnacle display there as well. Nice and easy to read. Clock and uh, outside temperature display on top of the dashboard and a bit lower down here we've got the AM and FM radio which also has a DAB setting as well which is new for this model here. Uh, we can also 
play media devices through here such as mp3s and ipods and we can also pair up a bluetooth phone as well single cd player on this uh, specification as well further down we've got the air conditioning and the heater display uh, knobs and buttons down here we can set that to four different settings and all the various settings are there uh, we've got a couple of 12 volt input sockets in the section down here along with the auxiliary and USB inputs and some extra storage in the front there button for the rear parking sensors 6 speed manual gearbox with a leather gear knob uh, a couple of um, cup holders in the centre here, this one you can lift out. Centre armrest with some storage underneath. Full size glove box illuminated and air conditioned to keep all your drinks nice and cool. And the books are all in there as you can see with the service book and all the owner's manuals. So there we go. Very, very smart example of the Kia C2. It's the 1.6 diesel, which is uh, very, very low on the emissions, so it's actually free to tax this car. Looks great in track red. Please contact us via the website to arrange a test drive, and thanks for watching.